actually, when I graduated from high school, wanted to go into nursing. So I ended up getting a bachelor's degree in social work and in nutrition. And when I graduated from college the first time, I really didn't know what I wanted to do. Got myself admitted to a graduate program in counseling. So my very first job with my counseling degree, I got hired by the American Cancer Society and I thought, oh good, I'm gonna get to do patient care and some social work, and it was mostly fundraising. So my next professional job was for Mahoning County Children's Services Board and I started working for a children's services unit, but I really enjoyed working with my families and that was probably my first experience in not judging people for what they had done. What I found out working there was I worked on a team with the guardian ad litem for the county, so she was put in charge of children, and then myself as the social worker and a nurse. And I kind of felt like the nurse was the most effective person on our team. She was the one who really got to do the heart of the work, but she got to do what I always wanted to do. I looked into going back in nursing and I thought, oh, this is gonna be a piece of cake. They accepted me, but they sent me to a branch campus in an associate degree program because they didn't have any space in the BSN program. So I was like, okay with that. So we had class on Mondays from eight to five and we went to clinical the next day. And it was not a cakewalk. It was the most humbling and hardest experience I ever had in my life. Incredibly rewarding. I graduated, got my first job at the local hospital in the town that I live. I wanted more patient contact. So I quit my job to work in a free medical free clinic and it was the best transition I ever made in my life. I absolutely loved it. So I went to a trade school to get a degree in coding and billing, and I got hired from that trade school to teach medical assisting. I found out Hondros did concept-based nursing, and that's what I was really interested in. And I kind of decided this is where I wanted to come. I absolutely love teaching. I love the brand new students. I am so impressed by our students they have so many things going on. They work full-time, most of them. They have children. And so many of our students have been STNAs or worked in the aid side of nursing. And that is the heart of nursing. I've been on the patient side numerous times. The most fascinating part to me is you recognize the good nurses immediately. Then when I got admitted for my kidney, almost all the nurses that I had had been previous students of mine, and I was so proud of them. And it really, truly, they were all so compassionate and concerned. That's probably what made it the most worthwhile, was that they had turned out to be terrific nurses. I love what I do. I love what I do. If I get up in the morning on the weekends, sometimes I come in here because, you know, want to watch TV at home. <laughs> I really like what I'm doing.